Welcome to The Bogart Effect, a Wealthy Wisdom Podcast. Please see important disclosure information at the end of the presentation. So tying all of that back, we know we talked about long-term care. What are the documents that a household needs? And and I think that it's so important to make sure your kids know where these things are. Where are are they? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean, we talked about the life events. Obviously, long-term care is one. But if even if you're out of country, right, or or obviously mentally, physically not able to, to make decisions on yourself, what if you're incapacitated, right? Yeah. I mean, you want to have that power of attorney in place. And so, great, I've got my power of attorney. You know, it first goes to my spouse, the next goes to my children. Something happens and my child needs to use it. Well, if they don't know where it is, yep. <laughs> how are they going to go to the yep. financial institution? Where do they go to do that? Um, sure, you can go to Schwab. You can go to any of the brokerage firms. And also, they have their own power of attorney forms. But guess what they need? To be notarized. Yeah. Right. Yep, and yep. so, if you're going, your parents incapacitated, you can't find their documents. Well, here's this one. But great, I also can't do that because yep. it needs a notary. So it's great to have the estate plan. It's great to have the conversation, but let them know where the documents are located. Well, and, and I think, you I know, mean, conversations, simple, right? it, it is, but it's not. Like yeah. I, I'm thinking of my dad right now and he and I just revisited this conversation, mm-hmm. right? And it's, well, they're in this safe. And then he goes, well, you know, it's a biometric safe. Well, that's, right. <laughs> <laughs> good luck. that doesn't do me a whole lot of good if I'm not on your safe, yeah. right? Um, so, we, of course, but it, that's part of it, right? I also think related to this, uh, anyone who's interfacing with an advisor, they really should have a copy of these documents as well. Yep, and right? we do, like right? For, we have a secure for all way. of our clients, we keep them on on a secure portal we have. I think if you're using an advisor, make sure your advisor, who's your trusted contact, also has a copy of vault. these. Yep. Um, so that because a lot of times, you know, one of the things I like to train our clients on is is make sure your kids know who we are. If they're not already clients, right? We don't want to be mom and dad's advisor. We want to be theirs as well. Yep. But it's one where they know mom and dad, something happened or, or they're somewhere and they need us to be able to help. Yep. Well, we can help if we have a copy of the document. So Absolutely. to me, it's it's the will, the power of attorney, the medical directives, if there's trust documents, have all of those in there, secure data portals. They're awesome for that. Yep. Digitize it. That way we're not relying on paper folders somewhere hidden on the exactly. shelf. Exactly. So they know how to access them, yeah. right? It, it seems simple, but it's um, You know, frankly, I'm going to throw a couple other things in there while we're talking about this conversation, though. If the kids need to have access to this. The previous podcast was intended for general information purposes only. The information discussed is no substitute for personalized investment advice from Bogart or another investment professional. Different types of investments involve varying degrees of risk, and it should not be assumed that the future performance of any specific investment, strategy, or service will be profitable, suitable, or successful. Bogart is not a law firm or accounting firm, and no portion of its services should be construed as legal or accounting advice. There is no guarantee a client will experience a certain level of results if Bogart is engaged. Our brochure describing services and fees can be found at www.bogartwealth.com. Thank you.